the unfortunate position of not having like a father figure like like I may have a father figure like my uncle or my godfather but my actual father is not really in my life Ashley is nosy Ashley is smart Ashley is the type of person who keeps to herself but is still outgoing at the same time Ashley is somebody who is passionate about the Black Lives Matter movement and is also passionate about animals. Ashley is somebody who lacks self-esteem but is still trying to get there and is still trying to achieve her goals. Ashley is a lot. I think when I moved to New York, you know, New York is a big place. You get a whole bunch of freedom. You meet new people. You learn a whole bunch of other things about yourself. Once I got into middle school, it really hit me like he's not like he's not making up promises. He's acting very childish. Like he's just not going to be in your life, and you need to accept that. One thing, especially that I think I was deprived from, was like like not a quote-unquote proper childhood because you see like other girls who have their dad and their mom in their life and they may get more things or they may get more attention or they may go more places or have more family outings it's just like i think i was deprived from like what a lot of people may consider a, like a good childhood like they have both parents in their lives um neither one is struggling but i i think also i was deprived from like complete joy and happiness because although like i love my mom like i see how strong she is i'm supportive of her is sometimes like when I, especially when I was younger, there's still that part of me that's like sitting in bed crying because, dang, he like, do you not love me? Like, was I a mistake? Like, it's just, I just feel like that's something that like a 10 year old, 11 year old, like 13 year old um, shouldn't have to be dealing with or shouldn't have to be thinking about. For um, three years, you have, Ashley, who don't know what she's doing. She's doing all this stuff, trying to, like I said, get attention from other people. And then you have high school Ashley for two years or three years, um, who's more calm and who isn't all over the place, but still trying to figure out what she needs to do and how to get herself back together. You have child Ashley, who at first wasn't really sure how to feel about her dad not being in her life, crying because he wasn't making up promises, crying because you he, he's yelling or doing all this other stuff. So I think one word that describes it is hectic because it's all over the place, but at the end, it, it, it gets better. My mom has impacted me as a person because for 15, almost 16 years, I've grown up looking at her bend over backwards for us to have a good life, for her to be successful, for me to be successful at the same time. And I still sit here like, oh my God, it's magic. Like, but over time, I realized the struggle that it actually takes. And it's like, if she can start from the bottom and get here, then I can do the same exact thing. The strength that I, the strength that I've gotten over these years, I think eventually it'll just come up to being success. Growth, a story by Ashley Clark. Um, just because I've grown a lot, and I just think this whole like this whole timeline of events just continues to grow and just show my growth in general. So I just think the title will be growth.